माइंड अगर आप एक एक पेन मैनेजमेंट से ओनली इस इंटरवेंशन नो सॉरी दिस इस ओनली अ पार्ट व्हाट आर द अदर मेन यू हैव टू बी इस बायो साइको सोशल मॉडल बेसिकली यू हैव टू बी इन्वॉल्व द साइकोलॉजिस्ट यू हैव टू बी आपके कल्चरल इश्यूज यू हैव टू सी द उसके फैमिली इश्यूज और अदर थिंग यू हैव टू कंसीडर अदरवाइज इट्स गोइंग टू बी पार्शियल ट्रीट बिकॉज यू आर कैटरिंग ओनली द वन पोर्शन नॉट द अदर so what for what are the problems like me i am from a public sector lot of problem i have to see you can't believe sometimes uh, i am going to for during my appointment uh, chief minister called me uh, i went to his office he said me one thing tell you have to do one thing like, uh, what you will not do the pain management okay okay like, okay i have to do so what other things i have to do dr rifat magni she is a system professor there so Patient is both patient is managed by, by her name and I along with my team we start to look under the table and gradually things speaks the same person same guy daily referring a patient then we please see this patient this is problem so it took time but you have to prove yourself objective here what are our objectives. to list the barriers to effective pain management to describe the basic principle of pain management to describe the clinical classification of pain and the specific feature of different type of pain to describe the development and implementation of interdisciplinary pain management plan barriers the most important one and the most difficult one to handle problem related to the patients problem related to health professionals and Problem related to the healthcare system. Patients, related to pain report, pain report, pain. Concern about distracting patients from treatment of underlying disease. Fear that pain means disease is worse. Concern about not being a good patient. If I will complain, he will not care about a good patient. Worries about unmanageable side effects. Concern about Becoming tolerant to pain medication, poor adherence with the analgesic regimes, reluctant to take pain medication, and fear of addiction. This is the most common thing. I think this is a common thing between the patient, barrier, and the health professional. What about the healthcare professionals? Inadequate knowledge of pain management. Most of the patient I have seen, uh, as I said, it's a it's it's an interdisciplinary, but. I have seen lot of patients uh, that came with the complications because of drugs. Why? Because it was not properly diagnosed, no history, no examination, and the most common thing, what what all of the physicians and my colleagues answers, answers they are they are putting on answers. Those in case sometimes I have seen patient believe you by renowned doctors, a combination of two or three answers. One is proofing their name. And other is uh, uh, paroxysm be sat and and what is the death one? So what you got? You got a gastritis or a renal failure, and the basic problem is still there. That is not catered. So we have to see these things. Sometimes neuropathic pain, they are they are not good to respond to the NSAIDs. We have to and patient has to continue for months, years on NSAIDs and have complications of drugs. Poor assessment of pain, concern about regulation of controlled substances, fear of patient addiction, concern about side effect of analgesics, and this is the thing what I have seen in my uh, uh, during my professional life. Concern about the side effect of analgesic. Sometimes you have not to concern about this, thing, especially in a cancer patient. I have seen lot of patients. Shakes that we have purchased in a more hospital, and we have referred many cancer patients there for such a. They are afraid of to give opiates. Addict now, then by the patient relative as well. Okay, and other patient are not giving instant in a proper dose. Okay, the patient may get a renal failure. So I think the palliative care is very important. You know, to decide what you have to do. Patient, you have to keep the patient pain free. Concern about patient become tolerant to analgesic. Healthcare system. Uh, I think all of them 
from start of mentor Dr. Jameel Sabit, he has faced Professor Brigitte Steve Saab, me, Dr. Shazad, all have faced these problems. This is a problem with the healthcare system. I think there is a denial phase, okay, there is some feel like pain medicine. They have to accept it. Not only the healthcare system, but all of the other department. They ask. <coughs> healthcare system, low priority given to cancer patient pain management, inadequate reimbursement of pain, the most appropriate treatment may not be reimbursed, restriction, restrictive regulation of controlled substances, problem of availability of treatment and access to it, OPI's availability. The care approach, comprehensive care consideration, deal with the total pain. Total pain, what do you mean by total pain? Like we have to do physical, psychological, family, social component and the cultural component as well. Through repeated conversation and supportive treatment that is comprehensive. Be flexible in your approach. Use an interdisciplinary team effectively, develop standard of pain control that may effectively prevent unnecessary suffering. Assessment. As we all know the definition of pain by the National Association for Study of Pain, an unpleasant sensory or emotional experience associated with actual or potential tissue damage or described in terms of such damage. But recently, a new definition is proposed by the International Association of ASP in August 2019 that is an aversive sensory and emotional experience typically caused by or something that caused by actual or potential tissue injury. Basically, pain is always subjective experience that is influenced to varying degree by biological, psychological and social factors. Neuropathic pain, pain initially caused by primary region or dysfunction of peripheral or central nervous system. That may be somatic or visceral, somatic may be superficial or opinion. <coughs> Symptoms. Symptoms are very weary and uh, I think as we said this is subjective. Patients especially with the neuropathic pain they have very different uh, symptoms. They, they will say like there is some burning feels, some current, like a sensation, like pins and needles. And the most important thing is, is, is the history. The history remains the key to understand the patient pain and describe it, the, directing the patient pain management scheme. The dual question of location, duration, the living factor need to be asked, other factors like Factor of pain respond to other uh, illness in the pain assessment by verbal, visual, and the face scale. These are the scale we usually use, and their treatment plan. Basic principle: yeah, educate patient and family. Investigate wisely and effectively. Investigation. I always believe you have to describe that investigation that change your management plan. If it will not affect your management plan, go towards subjective to the treatment. Don't waste time and money. Just give proper treatment. Do not delay, do not delay treatment. Treat the patient immediately. Use the pain, diet, and objective variation of pain. Have a good understanding of pharmacological and adjusting and Give medication. Sugar lane,